Natasha Patel. And I'm Joe Dawson. And welcome to Science Roundup. All the latest scientific studies and research explained to you in voices that sound important. It's just like the 6 o'clock news, except we know that data are plural. Here are the headlines. A new oral hormone-blocking drug may help with heavy menstrual bleeding. Progress on the research was delayed for years when male scientists said, Ew! Don't talk about that! A recent study shows that bees pollinate flowers better in the city than in the countryside. Perhaps the bees are just attracted to the larger dating pool on Bumble. A new study predicts that a transition to wood products in the construction of buildings would offset enormous amounts of carbon related to steel and concrete production. My god, he healed a nation and predicted the future. A new self-assembling 3D battery could charge in seconds. In keeping with tradition, Apple says they want no part of it. University of Helsinki research suggests that trees might be aware of their size. And if you're a tree self-conscious about your size, look out for my online resistance training series for trees, Soul Stumps! Research shows that men who are argumentative, disagreeable, unempathetic, and stubborn are more likely to own a high-status car. Joe, don't you own a Model 3 Tesla? No, Kasha, it's the Tesla Model X. They're completely different cars. They're dumb. And this study is dumb, frankly. Men who own expensive cars are disagreeable. I disagree! Scientists from The Ohio State University compared three popular brands of water pitcher filters and found that some are better at removing toxins than others. The study took longer than expected, though, because the researchers' roommates kept forgetting to refill the water pitchers. A study finds that even extinguished cigarettes give off toxins. This new form of cigarette exposure has been labeled after smoke or butt emissions. And my sympathy to the D.A.R.E. officer who has to warn middle schoolers about the dangers of butt emissions. A self-learning heating control system saves energy in buildings by controlling the thermostat. If AI controlling your air conditioner sounds scary to you, you're not alone. James Cameron just began production on Terminator 7, where the Terminator must go back and find Sarah Connor and give her a cardigan. Canadian researchers develop a faster test for cannabis quality. Well, leave it to Canadians to make weed nerdy. Engineers have created a device that sends rotten food warnings to smartphones, letting consumers and food distributors know when meats and other perishables have gone bad. It's kind of like your roommate texting you when the bathroom's off limits. UCLA researchers have joined with sushi restaurants to cut back on seafood fraud. But first, they'll have to track down a notorious gang of fish fraudsters. Al Carpone, Whitey Fish Bulger, John Cotty, Eel Chapo, and a mysterious figure known only as the Codfather. A study showed providing free eyeglasses to kids in China actually improved their math scores. What a punch to the gut for the U.S. China was beating us in math they could barely see. Strawberries could help reduce harmful inflammation in the colon. But you have to put them in your mouth. Men's testosterone levels are largely determined by their environment during childhood, according to recent research. Boys who grew up in lockers had lower levels of testosterone. In a related study, estrogen levels are largely determined by how many seasons of Gilmore Girls you own. A new artificial sensor that can detect surface shapes and structures mimics a human sense of touch. However, research faltered early on when scientists struggled to identify what human touch felt like. One promising option for a more efficient, rechargeable battery is made out of sodium, which is abundant in seawater. Talk about a salted battery. A new study shows that female short-tailed bats can size up a mate just by hearing his singing. Fellas, you can't go wrong with that all-time bat classic. 